guys, so I was actually watching Alyssa Rose's channel, and she has been doing like a spring cleaning series, which my house is pretty much all the way done. Um, just because when we moved, when we moved out of our apartment, I got rid of um, a bunch of things we didn't need. And then we moved in here, it was like March, and um, I got rid of way more things. So um, there's not a lot to like spring clean or deep clean because. I mean, I'm a stay-at-home mom. <laughs> if I get a bug up me, I literally go like deep cleaning something like once a week. So um, I'm not too worried about my house now. My car has gotten out of control. And when I'm saying out of control, it's like bad. Like my trunk can't even fit anything in there anymore. <laughs> so like my bags, reusable bags, are my passenger seat because I can't even get the, I can't even get them in the trunk. What we're going to do, inspired by Alyssa, is we're actually going to go do a car clean out. So, I'm really excited because, it one, it needs it, and two, I haven't washed my car since we moved to Washington. Like, at all. And I know it rains, so, like, there's no point in, like, deep cleaning it or washing it, like, in Utah, where you, like, at least wash your car, like, once a week. There's no point because it just rains here all the time, but I haven't washed it and, like, see if, you, if I can focus on it. My whole car is like covered and we have these big uh, trees up here and they just drop pollen all the time and I get like little seeds like stuck onto the car and it took, I mean look, they're still on there. They're still on there. So what we're going to do <laughs> is we are going to just go do a car clean out and I'm really excited. Zach is home with the kids. And I get to just like bump music and clean out my car and probably go to a store and buy some pants. Like what else could a mom ask for? Not much. So this is the before of the car. Um, I'm in line for the car wash now. It's a semi sunny day and forecasted to be sunny for the next two days, which means everyone's getting a wash. So, um, it doesn't look bad. Um, it rained really, really hard like two days ago and washed most of the stuff away, but it's still, I mean, I don't know if you guys can even see it, but it's bad. Like, I think like seeing the difference side by side, we'll be able to see how bad it truly is, which it's, it's not good. It's not the worst, the worst it, my car's ever been dirty, but kind of ever since I got this car, I've kept it really clean and it's kind of uh, really sad right now. So. so this is like the best angle of me, sorry, but they actually like hand wash it first and then, um, then you go through the tunnel wash, which is pretty cool. Um, like he's like washing my tires and rims and getting all the shit off. But I feel really weird recording right now, so. I mean, there's literally still fucking things on it. I'm not saying I'm impressed. It feels good to wash my car. But I could literally have done that myself. Maybe better for five, ten dollars instead of fifteen. And, but like there's still, literally still shit on my window. I don't know if you can see that. That's, there's still things on my car. This is not going how I want it to go today. 
Okay, so there's one thing I do have to do off camera, which is I have a whole bag of aprons um, I have to take back to Starbucks. And I feel really weird, like, vlogging going in, especially after I quit not that long ago. So I am going to go take those in. I'll be right back. I feel like it's taken me 17 hours to do four things. Um, I've only done two things, which is wash the car, fail, take my aprons in, succeeded at that. And then Zach made me go buy a pair of pants because chub rub is a real thing. And you ruin your pants real quick, especially if they're shitty quality. So I have like two pairs of pants that have like holes in the thighs. And I only have two pairs of pants. One pair of green pants. And then these ones um, that I got from Maurice's. And they don't, I barely bought them, but they don't have holes in them. So he's like, I don't care. Go buy yourself some jeans. So I went to Old Navy. And I actually got two pair, two things, um, two pairs of pants, I should say. One pair of jeans and then one pair of leggings. Um, I'm not gonna show the leggings because like light, like lavender color is not flattering on anybody except for who's super toned. So I'm not gonna show those on camera. Those are for my working out purposes only. But um, so I'm gonna go donate. Oh, I didn't mention this. I have to donate some clothes that are in the back of my, uh, in the trunk. They're like Sunday's clothes that are too small for them. So um, that's the next thing. And then we're gonna go home and I am gonna clean the shit off the car that the car wash is supposed to. And then also like clean and dust, clean and dust like this area right there. So I'm gonna go ahead and go home and do that. I'm gonna drop off those donated clothes first. So in here, this is um, the spare tire. <laughs> um, it actually, um, it's in really good condition and that's the only reason I kept it. So if it wasn't in good condition, I would have just given it up or sold it or something. But it was basically brand new and I bought my four brand new tires. So, but what I'm gonna do is take in all the things that don't need to be in the truck, including my purse and our camel back. And I'm gonna current or temporarily take out the kites because I do want them to stay in the car. But I think I'm gonna try and bring everything in right now. So everything in. So now is the task of getting these puppies off. So I tried even scraping it a little bit earlier and it's coming off. Um, so. Okay, I have to finish the rest off camera because I can't like hold it and then spray and wipe um, with one hand. So. So it's a lot better um, than it was, but there's, I mean, there's still on there for sure. So I'm giving up on that for the night. I'm gonna finish the, the inside. I don't think I showed the dash like before I cleaned it. So. It looks dusty just because I was like using, I wasn't using a microfiber rag. Um, I mean, that looks so much better and you probably can't even see it. It looks so much better. So, I mean, that whole, this whole area looks so great compared to what it is. So the only thing you really have to do now is just um, vacuum. And look, there's cotton in our car. I wonder what my allergies have been like killing me right there right there I don't think I showed the rest of the car so let me do that so like I said I still need to vacuum but 
And this is like the last bit of random things that I have to take in the house, so. But, other than that, it's like literally all just things that go in here. So this is of trash, and then that is recycling, so things are going pretty good. Um, I think I'm going to be done for the night. So that is it for today's video. Um, I'm just kind of experimenting what I like to do. Um, so it's kind of all over the place, but that's my life. So um, just in case we do find out tonight, I might be going to Utah. Um, and, and it's not for a happy special occasion, but I might be going and I'll explain more if I do. So 